Hey, welcome back everybody. I uh, hope everybody's doing good. It's been about a week since I've done a review. And I got one today still trying to finish off my fireball category here. I just hit Meyer, my local Meyer. Took on a few groceries like about a month ago and haven't really been able to I mean I've drank it a shot here and there, but I think this is really good as a mixer. I bring so many shots of this. We've talked about it. I'm a fireball fanatic, but when you when you went out for years and decades of just and when you say you want a shot and everybody was like, Well, fireball. It's it's good, it's easy, cheaper, you know, nobody's really drinking, none of my friends are me really drinking straight tequila or straight bourbon, so, and it's a lot better than doing a, like a cheap, like, sugary shot, so, but anyway, today we're going to do root beer, I got A&W, classic 12-pack, um, let's get into it, boys, I need a glass, um, fuck, I need one second here, I gotta get my, uh, my shot glass, and so I'll hear these drinks up. I layer these drinks up just to see. This is just something I do. Got my Columbus Clippers shot glass. Fucked me in the ass last night. Beating Iowa on a bet. Six rounds, Huntington Park. So here we go to a shot. I do a double because it's like why? Why not do a double? You know. I think. Let's get it down in there. Oh shit! I overboard that. Oh boy. Not good. Thanks a little shot. And then we get some classic A and W root beer here. You know, layer it up. Um, but so, let me know uh, uh, what your favorite root beers are. It's another kind of review I want to dive into. Um, and one more shot here. This is a little less toned down. The other one was a little overkill. And then it's a little top of a little more root beer here. But again, let me know what you guys think is your uh, your go-to root beers. Um, you know, A&W is good. Again, mass-produced. Um, up that finger, give that quick spin. Um, yeah, I, you know, like I said, I I keep hearing about a beta root beer. That's one that I keep hearing about. So we still got a good amount of level in this fireball. Um, trying to get through these mixers. Cheers, guys. Delicious. He's right. My buddy just said that's dangerous and very good. Wow. Cinnamon's toned down. The root beer they hit. It's a nine out of ten for me. That's a great drink. Um, I was skeptical about doing it. Um, but it really, it's really good. The cinnamon is toned down. You still taste cinnamon, but it, it's definitely cooled and and brought back a bit because that, that's. I like cinnamon, but cinnamon is such a strong scent. We went through this that it, it always is like it just it's hot, like it hits, and, and like the root beer turns this down to balance. This is a great drink, dangerous. You don't really taste alcohol. Um, the root beer is kind of cut too. You know, it's weird because like they cut they cut each other as far as the flavors, but they mix well. You know, it's almost like you know root beer is a pretty strong flavor too. I think cinnamon's stronger, but root beer is still a strong taste. Well done, nine out of ten. Cheers, everybody, again. Let me know some more fireball mixers that you watching and also what are your favorite root beers. We'll see you soon. Thanks again.